every Saturnine buddy. Well, this is a game that takes place in space on board a space station called Observation. In the last episode, we finally gained access to the three Chinese modules that make up the Shenzhou arm of the gigantic space station. Uh, we're helping Mei reattach the hatch clamps so she can access the hatch and then uh, reunite with us. And that's where this picks up. Well, all right, so all it did is just give us a map of the Chinese arm, and it's all of just three modules. That's interesting. But um, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. So, lady, wait, don't go outside yet. So this is, um, yeah, this is the um, module that connects to the UN ring, which is where we're in now. We're trying to open this hatch up between this and this. So let's actually take a look at this. We can probably look around and maybe uh, connect to something. I don't know. Oh, look, it's the same thing. So the power, whatever this is, whatever's going on here, 314, maybe we just have to wait for her to uh, reattach those hatch clamps because remember she said that she's going outside to do a little spacewalk. Well, why can't I do it again? Oh, look, data drop uploaded. Yes. Okay, actually, this will still play even if we leave, so that's cool. Okay. Oh, that's Ailsa Yang. Okay, what about uh, this one is the Haisheng module, and then, oh, three is the Wenchang module. Um, so what am I supposed to do here? Let's uh, take a look at our objectives. Fix the high priority station alerts. Oh. Oh. So I guess that's what we have to do still. So um, the way to do that is to go back to the uh, the UN modules, which are here. Uh, let's go back here. Uh, Emma's still here. Uh, let's find out what she wants us to do. You know, there's all these other modules that we haven't even uh, looked at yet. See, like this one, this one. Let's go back here, figure out what the other uh, station alerts are. Okay, so here's another station alert. Crew tracker sensors. Yeah, see, did you notice that every time we tried to activate a crew tracker, uh, it was offline, so maybe we should uh, inform the crew. The connection between crew tracker functionality and SAM OS has been severed. I need those sensors working. Go get them online and I'll fix up the crew tracker from this end. Okay, the sensors. So, <laughs> where are the sensors for the crew tracker? That's a good question, isn't it? That's like the question of the century. Where the fuck are those crew trackers? Uh, let's see, crew tracking. Any there it is, crew tracking sensors. So there's one here, there's one here, there's one here. Maybe we have to kind of, maybe we have to get all these working. I think that's what we have to do. Okay, now remember the crew tracker sensor was here. Aha, see. So zoom to interact, and then. Let's add the system link. Maybe we have to just do this three times in the three different uh, modules that we saw them in. Okay, good, now we can connect to it. Hey, oh my God, this is like Windows 95 interface. Sensoric calibration tour. Uh, let's do the, hey, I went to click it and it changed. Enable sensor power control interface, yes. Okay, let's adjust it. Oh God, this thing is, No, 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 no. There. Now, sensor calibration test. Let's test it. <laughs> what? Spot check system available. Okay. Blue to blue to green. What? Oh, I guess it wants me to just. Are you kidding me? This is like. <clears throat> what is this? Sensor this... one is online and receiving data. Well, I'll be damned. It wasn't even Tetris, it was just uh, 
match the colors. Oh, come on, now that was kind of silly. It's just the fact that this is a little arduous that uh, makes these puzzles challenging. But I mean, that alone wasn't challenging at all. But okay, so now we, but you have to see, you have to think about the larger picture, like the whole station. So we got that running. Now, UNL1's sensor array is offline. Ooh, look, stuff is floating around in space. Oh, we should probably secure those back where they came from. Okay, so here's the same thing. It's probably going to be the same stupid thing. So we'll just do this two more times. Three, one, two. Thank you for pairing. Now hold the connect. Yeah, same thing. There. Enable sensor power module adjust W. I'm holding down. See, it's pretty obvious what you have to do here. And then sensor calibration test. Oh, there. Sensor enabled. Now enable sensor calibration test. So white to green. Oh, come on. Okay, white to green. Hey, yellow to green. Okay. Oh. Maybe I clicked on the wrong thing. I don't know. I don't know what I did there. That's yeah. online now as well. Nearly there. Yep, we're nearly there. Okay, let's get out of here. Now we're going to go to the other one, which is over here in UN06. And you notice way over on the right, whenever you uh, um, mouse over something, it shows the current camera that's available for that module C. So now we're going to go to UN06. UN06. Where is the sensor module? Where is the crew tracker sensor module? Oh, there it is. Commander Tubak would love this place because of the sensor modules. There we go. And okay, enable sensor power control interface. Same thing. Adjust. Oh come on. Yeah, that takes a. Now, oh, I see. So I click it and it changed colors. So orange to green. Ding ding. Ding, 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 ding. Click and then clack, clunk. Oh, I'm missing one. Oh, there it is. That's them all online now. <laughs> Boy, if you're colorblind, here. screw this test. What? You got them all online? Crew tracker is online. Yay, it's online. Where's my crew, Sam? Oh, we can find the crew now. Good. Yeah, enter the SAM OS at any time by pressing this. And now look at this, we have a new option here. It says Crew Tracker. Where is everybody? Where, first of all, I'm interested where uh, Josh is. Remember Josh was the uh, guy who was uh, dating uh, Emma, I guess? <gasps> where is he? Location unknown. What kind of a crew tracker is that? And he, yeah, he's part of the EAS uh, uh, team. Hey, whoops, crew tracker. And then what about Ailza, the Chinese lady? Unknown? What kind of a crew tracker is this? Emma, well, we know where she is because, yeah, duh, UCL1. Hey, Emma, uh, her blood pressure is 128 over 80. Oh, that's cool, we get a constant readout of her vital stats. And Stanislav Leonov, oh, he's in the Russian module somewhere. Oh, UC01. <gasps> oh, we should report that. Stanislav Leonov is located in UC01. Tell me about the rest of the crew, please, Sam. Exclude Stanislav Leonov from the crew status report. Oh, yes, Keep he checking. died. He died. I think he's the one who was dead. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have... Uh, uh, told her about that. It's a touchy subject. What about Jim? Why don't I at least report that he's um, oh, Russian error. Jim Elias is Russ error. Captain Jim Elias is located in the Russian arm. Aha. I am unable to determine his exact location. Ooh. How is he? Any vitals? No. There is no, no. biomedical data being oh, received. Oh, that's cool. You just mouse over and press Jim Elias. Okay, what about Josh? Please tell me you have something on it. Yeah, see, she... Oh, she loves jazz. No. 
The location of Josh Ramon is unknown. Is there any sensible data coming through for him? No. Is the tracker functioning? No. There is no biomedical data being received for Josh Ramon. The biosensors can't be working. Is the tracker functioning? Uh, the tracker is not functioning. The tracker for Josh Ramon is showing a weak connection. Oh, I don't oh. understand. Maybe there is some interference. May, we've got a fix on Jim. He's in the Salute somewhere. Good. Get him to sort this mess out. Tell him he owes me an explanation. Wait. It looks like your camera's in the Russian armor offline. Let me get that for you now. Get a visual on the captain for me, Sam. Where is he? All right, so now we have access to the Russian arm of the space station, and now we have to find the Captain Josh. So we'll do that in the next episode, all right? If you like this, then click the thumbs up button, and please subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications on. That way you'll get these episodes uh, in your inbox every time I go live with one, all right? Or just come back to the channel anytime. We'll see you next time on Space Station observation. Thanks for watching.